Hi everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to my trying a new makeup product everyday series. Today I am so excited to finally be trying out this super popular hyped up eyebrow pencil and it's from CoverGirl. It's the Easy Breezy Brow Micro Fine and Define Pencil. So I picked this up from Ulta in my recent huge Ulta makeup haul, which if you haven't seen that video yet, I have that unboxing up here on my YouTube channel. But this is a pencil that I've been wanting to try out for years. It's one of my favorite YouTubers, Kelly Strack. It's her favorite brow pencil and she uses it in so many videos. And I picked this up in the shade Honey Brown. And at Ulta, it cost me $9. But this seriously has like everything I look for in a brow pencil because it has a spoolie. It's a twist up, a super tiny pencil to make it easy and precise. So I'm really excited to try this out. I am so picky with my brow products and how my brows look. So I am very excited to finally be trying this out. It also has great reviews on the Ulta website. So let's start out with a swatch. Oh good. The shade Honey Brown, I was worried it was gonna look a little bit too red or orange, but it looks like a nice, like kind of medium shade of brown. And I feel like I've tried out so many different brow pencils like this at this point. Like this is nothing any, all that like different or extraordinary, but for the price point, I'm hoping for just a great classic go-to brow pencil. So love that it has the spoolie, just flipping it over. Now I'm gonna go ahead and fill in some sparse areas. I like that it's initially going on looking like nothing in the brows, like leaving no texture, crumbliness. It writes very easily. I can get pretty fine lines, but overall I end up just filling in my brow, not necessarily making the look of hair-like lines. I feel like this writes a little bit thicker than like my brow hairs at least. So I feel like I'm gonna get better use just like filling in the brow completely than trying to draw in hairs. But this is the technique that I do pretty much every single day when I do my brows. So fill it in, shape it, then brush through with the spoolie to smooth it all through. I think this shade is maybe a little bit darker, slightly off from my natural brow hairs, but wow. <laughs> Look at how quickly and easily I was able to fill in, shape my brow, and get it to look seriously exactly how I always try and get my brows to look. I'm just filling in the tail a little bit here. And I don't even really make my brows look a certain way every day. Like, I just kind of follow the shape. And sometimes my brows are different shaped <laughs> than other days, but. Overall, I would say this is exactly what I tried to achieve. Like it looks completely undetectable throughout the brow, even though you can see such a dramatic difference with it versus without it, it doesn't look like product in the brow. Like no crumbliness, nothing like that. It has no hold to it. It's not like a waxy pencil. So this is exactly what I would go over with a brow gel as part of my regular daily brow routine. And I love it. So quick, easy. I am understanding the hype. And I actually really like how this shade looks on me. So now on the other brow, I always brush through the brow hairs first since they're usually <laughs> all over the place. And then just, I like to start in the bottom corner and just kind of fill my way, usually from the bottom up so that I can start with the arch and then go a little bit lighter in the center here. And then I'll use a little bit more pressure to darken it up towards the tail. But I do love how microfine and small the pencil is so that I can get precise in my shape. 
and then flipping it over. And I love that the pencil does like smudge, I guess is how I would describe it. Like I want it to be able to blend through and soften as I brush it through with the spoolie. And this does that perfectly. And then I always just kind of take my finger and like soften up the front and this like texture of brow pencil where it does kind of like smudge, I guess, is perfect for this to really soften up those areas where I went in a little harsh with the pencil. It's so easy to soften that up. Oh, and I love how my brows look right now. They do look to me natural, like so easy and quick for me to put on my brows and I just love this finished look right now. This is absolutely a new favorite brow pencil for me, one that I will be using as a go-to because seriously, like my brows are exactly what I was hoping to achieve. So if you've tried this out, let me know what you think of it in the comments down below. And if you're someone who's just trying to get into filling in your brows or just wanting to try out a brow pencil like this, this is such a great option to try because I really do feel like it's so easy and just everything I would recommend and look for in a brow pencil. So thank you so much for watching my video today. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day. And I will see you tomorrow in my next video.